Welcome to PC Wits Kids Tech Talk. Well, I wanted to show you the Kingston HyperX 2 gig of DDR memory that I had because I benchmarked it against other brands and this one with 2 gigs matched or beat other kits that were 4 gigs. So I really have to make note here from my previous benchmarks when I've used this RAM and compared it, it actually does better. Now it is a little bit more expensive, anywhere from like 10, 20, 30 dollars, depending on which which brand of the, uh, uh, or model I should say, of the HyperX that you're getting. So if you're gonna get it for the new uh, Core i7, for example, or the new Core i5s that are coming out, then uh, that's fine, you know, you can get this because this one here, right, will work actually better. Okay, then your regular no-name brands or even the cheaper brands like G-Skill, right? I know that there's lots of cool looking RAM out there. It's got nice heat spreaders and all this, but looks is not everything, right? Uh, on this system that I'm using it on, as you can see, I've overclocked everything uh, as much as I could, okay, on this system. And uh, I stress tested the system, made sure that this 2 gigs was stable, right, at these overclock speeds. And... Um, that's one thing that I wanted to, to, to point out here with this, right, is that you can overclock it. You don't have to worry about it um, bringing down your machine. It's stable RAM, and it's of good quality, lifetime warranty. And um, when I benchmarked it, like I said, against the Patriot, the Corsair, the OCZ brands that I've got, this one actually beat or matched all of them. And it was just with 2 gigs compared to the other ones that I installed 4 gigs. So imagine if I installed... 4 gigs of this instead of 2. Now the memory timings 99927 is what I used of course and um, when it comes to benchmarks here 47.9 nanoseconds is the latency so it's super fast compared to other brands as you can see here the Patriot, the OCZ and the Corsair they're all uh, a little bit slower okay so that's one thing to note right off the bat there that the Kingston HyperX is faster Okay, no doubt about it, including the read uh, megabytes uh, per second, for example, definitely faster there. The write as well and the copy. On all scores, this HyperX beat all of these brands, okay? So I really had to make a note here and just make a, a follow-up video so that you can see what I'm talking about because a lot of you are asking me what type of DDR to get and if money is not a, not a problem, right, and you want to get the best of the best, then you want to get the Kingston HyperX, for example. Now, I'm not saying that the other brands that I've used, Patriot, OCZ, and Corsair, those are great RAMs as well. They did terrific, okay? I'm not putting those down at all. I'm just saying that this one here, with just two gigs, look at the scores. I mean, you can't beat that, right? It shows you that uh, the quality of Kingston is still there. They are truly uh, masters of memory, and uh, that's what they're known for. So anyways, I'd like to uh, thank Kingston for providing it, and I hope you enjoyed this video, and thank you for watching.